Another beautiful day, perfect for some scary stuff. I found some creepy ass footage that I want to share with you guys. It's both really bizarre stuff and also like creepy paranormal stuff. We have a good mix in this video. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet or liked any of the videos or clicked the fucking bell button, why haven't you? Why haven't you? Do we need to have this discussion each and every time? No, I didn't think so. We have some creepy videos we're going to jump right into right now. Let's do this! Starting off with the robot stripper. You heard me. Just watch it and see yourselves. <laughs> Settling as a video can be, this one sure takes the cake. The video features a worse for wear robotic stripper dancing up against a mirror. The robot is dressed in white lingerie while wearing a dark goblin-like mask and appears to have been dragged behind a car. Or at yeah. least that's what it looks like since its whole body is covered in dirt and grime. <laughs> yeah. The stripper dances yeah. rhythmically to a loud Katy hell? Perry movie. What makes the video so unsettling is that the robot is programmed oh, no. to look directly into the eyes that is of disgusting. anyone watching. Look at her eyes! Look at her eyes! Look at that! What the hell? Who's getting turned on by that? And why is she dirty? Why is this robot all filthy? It actually looked like, like they said, like she's being... Why am I saying she? It looks like the freaking robot has been dragged from a car or something like that. Why is the dog... <laughs> Shame on you, society. Shame on you for turning on on things like this. What the... Watching during its performance. Midway through the video, the music cuts out, and at that point, we find out that the stripper robot is actually whispering a long bear. What the hell? Look at those teeth! Look at her teeth! <laughs> what the hell? Who is getting turned on by that? Is this Elon Musk's fault? You fucking crazy bastard, this is your fault. <laughs> Barely understandable run-on sentence, all while dancing its robotic heart out. Yeah, baby. Okay, that was... <sighs> I'm out of words. I, I don't know what to say right now, that was just too much. And the next video is uh, a guy who's apparently being pushed by a shadow. Pushed by a shadow? Let's watch that. Let's have a look together, you and me. In the footage, we see a boy come through the door and pause to carefully wipe his feet. The position of the light above him casts a shadow on the wall next to him. Nothing seems amiss at first until the shadow suddenly begins to move on its oh, own. Oh no! Oh no! In a Hell split no! Second, the shadow reaches out and shoves the boy, who trips forward into the room. No! What the hell? <laughs> Unable to see the shadow behind him, he returns to the door and looks around. That for the can't culprit. be real. He's baffled and eventually gives up searching for an explanation. It's only when reviewing the footage that the truth becomes clear. Yeah, look at that. Love to keep your thoughts on this one. What do you think, real or fake? Let us know in the comment section below. Um, my opinion is that it feels a bit, a bit too much. It feels fake if you ask me, but still, I have I have no proof. So what what can I say? But if it is true, it's uh, it's truly kind of bizarre, <laughs> kind of bizarre situation. Imagine being pushed by your own shadow. <laughs> God must hate this guy. <laughs> Next video. Next clip comes from a security camera outside the Postgraduate Institute of Medical Education and Research in Chandigarh, India. At the start of the creepy footage, we see a wheelchair parked along the edge of a patio. Things get really spooky when the wheelchair suddenly begins to move forward. Oh, on it's, its moving! Own. It's moving! It crosses the patio, rolls down the stairs before continuing onto the sidewalk. That's definitely the ghost of Steve Hawkins. <laughs> I'm kidding, relax! You have to be able to make a joke from that. I respect that guy. I think he was awesome, but you have to be able to take a joke. You are so going to hell. Look at him going. 
It eventually enters the garden and steers itself around a pillar as it heads for the hospital exit. Yeah, he's like, screw this hospital. <laughs> the director bye bye, Steve. of the hospital believes that the incident can be explained by a smooth floor and wind. Bye but bye. others are less sure. The security guard seen in the footage insists that there was no wind that night and that the patio was eerily cold. He and other <laughs> members of the hospital staff believe... <laughs> He's just... Wait a minute. Look at the look at the security guard. Look at him. Look at him. He's just standing there, watches the wheelchair roll away. He's like, I was just owned by Steve Hawkins. Definitely. It seems that there was no wind that night. Next video is a really bizarre freaking video. It's it's a dude who's trying to be creating his own humunculus humunculus and that's that, that's like the oh sorry fucking microphone <laughs> i mean a humunculus is like a a small version of a human a human ish i know it's really weird just look at the video look at the video homunculus a homunculus is a very small or miniature humanoid like creature often created through artificial means a homunculus is a rational animal and a supposed microscopic oh, but fully that. formed the human being the russian youtuber attempts to create a homunculus by using a method that involves a chicken egg human sperm and bandages wait 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 what did it just say did they need human sperm as well? How how is okay, let's just watch the video. He starts the process by cutting a tiny hole into the shell of the egg, sticking a syringe filled with his own semen into the egg yolk. What? With his own semen? What the hell is wrong with the world? You could might as well have fucked a chicken or something. <laughs> and injecting the semen into the yolk. Finally, he puts ah! the bandage over the hole and waits. His hope is that the semen and the egg will mix and create a living creature. What comes out of the eggs after a few weeks is nothing but disturbing. In the first video, after waiting 10 days, the man cracks the ah! egg and dumps the contents into a plastic no! bowl. Out of the murky goop, he manages to pull out a disturbing, semi-assembled, possibly alive creature. On possibly alive creature? What? On closer inspection, we can see that one of the extended arms slowly curls up on its own. No! Whether or not the creature was actually alive <laughs> is debatable. In the second no! video, again <laughs> after another initial no, waiting period, the man again. cracks open a newly incubated no! egg into a plastic container. This time, what the man pulls out of the murky egg appears to be somewhat sentient. For a few moments, the creature observes its surroundings <laughs> before finally landing its gaze on the Russian. The creature then shoots <sighs> a clear liquid into the face of the man, causing what? him to react Shoots some liquid into the man's face. Sounds like a porno to me. <laughs> I'm kidding. Sorry. Violently and crushing it with a large book. In the third and final <laughs> video, the man tries once more so to create disgusting. a homunculus. This time he inseminates over 20 different chicken eggs. Dressed in a full hazmat suit. That dude has too much spare time. Too much spare time, okay? It's just... What is he doing with his life? He's sitting there in the kitchen with his own semen and injecting it to like eggs. And now he's wearing a full suit, a protecting protection suit. <laughs> what is wrong with people? <laughs> He opens each egg one by one, only to find out that each produced nothing. Uh, and thankfully so. Yes, thankfully so. I'm really glad he he failed with his own experiment or whatever it was. The last video is some kind of video where a, a, a ghost boy or ghostly boy is calls out for his papa or something. He, it sounds sad. Even more terrifying. Whether it's their childlike voices or big sad eyes, there's just something about a child ghost that strikes fear into even the bravest of hearts. If this video is to be believed, the spirit of a child may have made the Tharagotha metro station in Monterrey, Mexico his eternal resting place. Two witnesses, a metro worker and a passenger, are frightened to hear the voice of a young boy echoing through the station. No. The voice repeatedly calls for Papa, no. sounding increasingly more terrified. Ah, oh, poor thing. No, no, no. It's so hard when it's like kids involved. 
The two witnesses head towards the voice, but are baffled when they're unable to locate the source of the chilling voice. I'm dead. Even as the cries become louder, the two witnesses are no closer to locating the boy. Oh no, 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 this is just so sad. I mean, on the other hand, th th this is a really, this is a really clear and yell loud. No, no, <laughs> I'm sorry, I said it wrong. This is a really loud and clear yelling. And it doesn't feel like spirits or ghosts or whatever are able to produce that much energy in order to do something that that loud. It was so loud and clear. I mean, I, I think it's like a, a real boy who's trapped somewhere. I, I don't know if it is like a spirit of a boy or a ghost or whatever you want to call it. I don't know. I, I don't know. But if it is... God bless that little boy, man. That's just so sad. That is so sad. That's too much for me. So we're gonna call it for today before this video ends up too long. Thank you very much for watching this video. Did you watch the whole thing or did you just click yourself through it? Because I see many of you guys are doing that. Watch my full videos and don't forget to subscribe. Do you want me to continue with watching creepy videos with you guys? Do you want me to continue with this? Let me know in the comment section below, because right now you aren't typing a shit. So just say something. Say something to me. I feel lonely. <laughs> I, have, I have no friends, okay? And um, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and hit that little lovely bell button. I know you can do that. I know you can do that, because you know what? I believe in you. I, I really believe in you, okay? I believe in you.